Good afternoon. Southeastern New Mexico is facing a unique problem. In an area where the oil fields are booming, there aren't enough places to eat. The other problem, finding people who will take a minimum wage working there when the oil companies pay so much more. Elena Mendoza reports. What's supposed to be a fun family outing, going out to eat. You have to wait a long time whenever you order anything. Half the time you get what you want. Often ends up being more of a hassle in Carlsbad. Residents say restaurants are overcrowded and there aren't enough employees. This town can support a lot of, a lot more restaurants, but they can't staff them. The issue, why would people want to work for minimum wage when the oil field pays a lot more? For instance, some of these fast food restaurants are paying $12 and $14 an hour to try to keep help. Uh, some of them close early. Uh, Blake's Slaughter Burger closes at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. And Blake's isn't alone. Many restaurants have altered their hours. Sonic closes some of its stalls to reduce orders, and nearly all of them have now hiring signs out front. McAllister's Deli is one of the many places feeling the effects. Carlsbad is by far the hardest to staff. You know, with the oil field and as well as all the uh, service companies that service the oil field, you know, there's a lot of money there and so it becomes a real challenge. An outside Arby's, a sign that reads, negotiate your pay. It's an unexpected effect of the booming oil industry. The oil field is, you know, it's a, it's a good industry and brings a lot of jobs to the community. And, but it, it's also a competitive factor with other people and other jobs. City Councilor J.J. Chavez says some restaurant chains are hesitant to come here because of the issue. He says they're working on combating that, hoping to bring more housing developments in soon, giving people permanent places to live and building the regular population. We're developing and we're working on the problem as we go. It's a good problem to have. In Carlsbad, Elena Mendoza, KRQE News 13. Another reason some chains are hesitant to build is the population isn't big enough. The Department of Development estimates the population of Carlsbad is about 75,000. Some of the bigger restaurant chains require at least 100,000 residents.